And it's hard to believe it's already the fourth Monday of August, and that means we get to check in with Al Bear and our very own Stacy Dempsey of the Frosted Apron for the Monday Manger. And they have a really clever take on your traditional salads, so let's see what they're up to. Hey Taylor, it is Monday. Time for the Monday Manger with Stacy Dempsey <laughs> at the Frosted Apron. Yeah. Stacy, look at all this. What are we gonna do? How do you say cr you say crouton or crouton ow? I say crouton, like okay. futon, crouton. How do you say it? I say it really fast and it just comes out like crouton. Crouton. It, that's just how it comes out. Man. But I'll I'll try to say crouton. Maybe we we'll get the viewers to email Taylor. Let us know. Yeah. How do you say it? You, you, you <laughs> be the arbiter be of this, Taylor. Two we don't know. We crouton. Okay, I'm gonna say it like crouton. You. Crouton. So we're making crouton. Ah, oh, I said it right? Okay. Um, salad bowls. Okay. All of them. All yeah. And it's way cheaper to do it this way than bag a, buy a bag of croutons. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna laugh every time I say it now. Oh my God, that's funny. Okay, so look. This is like rolls. Mm -hmm. So this is your local grocery store has the bags in the bakery stuff, yeah, in the yeah. bakery area. This was four dollars for 12 of, 12 of these rolls. They're called hard rolls. Yeah. Um, they don't, they're not slit like in half. Right. This is hamburger rolls. These were three dollars for eight of them. These aren't slit in half either. Mm -hmm. um, this is what you want. Something about this size, okay? So um, that's already made. So all you do is you hit them with the roller and you oh, flatten nice. them out. But you can use your hand. I saw you washed your uh, yeah your hands. So because I just finished that. thoracic surgery and my hands are clean too. But isn't it just better just to oh, do yeah, this? Oh yeah, look, I tell you what. Let the kids do them. Real chefs use their hands. Yeah. So then we want to do a stick of butter. Okay. okay. We want to melt that up. I'm going to turn these over. We're mixing two teaspoons of garlic powder. Yum. Okay. Now, normally when I make my garlic butter, I, I use fresh mm -hmm. garlic, but um, I don't want this to burn in the oven, the little pieces of yeah. garlic. So I'm using the garlic powder. Oh, good point. Yeah. And use unsalted or salted butter, whatever you got in your fridge. Okay. So you want to just brush the bottom of that bread and it's okay if it's stale, like a day or two. Mm -hmm. That even, that makes a better crouton. Crouton, what is it? Or futon. <laughs> okay, so the butter is already on this side. Gotcha. So you wanna flip it so you don't have to grease your muffin pan because it has that butter. That's cool. So, and I, can you see I'm using the large muffin pan? Gotcha. All right, so then after you do this, you just wanna brush that on. I know we short on time. And then you wanna do salt. You wanna do pepper. And then it's 375 in the oven mm -hmm. for 16 minutes. Okay. But halfway through, take them out, sprinkle, sprinkle some Parmesan on the bottom, and then finish baking it for the rest of the eight minutes. Okay. And then they're done. And when we come back, we're gonna put all this together. Don't go away. These, we're gonna do something with croutons. Or croutons. Or croutons. <laughs> back to you. I feel like it's tomato, tomato, and still to come. You will check back in in a few minutes. But guys, we have to check in with our very own Al Bear and Stacy Dempsey of the Frosted Apron. It's the fourth Monday of the month, so it's time for the Monday Manger. They're making these crouton bowls, so let's see how they're going. Hey guys. Hey, we are back. Monday Manger, Stacy Dempsey, the Frosted Apron. Okay, so we've got this. Remind us where we are and how we got here. Okay, so we're making crouton salad bowls. So this is a great presentation. It's actually cheaper to make than buying a bag of croutons and yeah, making a salad. No doubt. Um, so this is just already made bread. They're, they're rolls that you yeah. can buy in the bakery section. Um, so all we did was we flattened them. Well, you used your hand. I did. You did it the easy way. You can roll I'm it out strong. or show us, you know, have the kids flatten the bread out. Just like you're doing CPR. Yeah. And you flatten the bread. And so then all you do is a stick of garlic, a stick of butter, and then two teaspoons of garlic powder. And you flip the roll over, you brush it, and then you just form it inside the muffin pan. And this yeah. is a large muffin pan. Um, and then once you do that, once you have it all fit in there, you just brush it again with the garlic butter, and then you hit it with some pepper and some salt. Come on, the salt. All right, like that. 
and it's 375 degrees mm -hmm. for about 15 or 16 minutes in the oven. But you want to take it out halfway, about eight minutes, mm -hmm. and you want to sprinkle the shredded um, Parmesan cheese on there and then put it back for the rest of the eight minutes. And then it's done. And if you have some extra garlic butter left over, just brush it on there because you can't have enough garlic you butter. You can never have too much garlic. <laughs> so this is how, let me show you this one. So this is done. Look at this. It's nice. crispy. It tastes just like a crouton. You can add um, Italian seasoning if you want. Yeah. Or you can just do the salt and pepper. Okay, so let's do our salad. Okay. So we're going to do a Caesar salad. Okay. So that's Caesar dressing. Use both of these? You don't have to. I didn't know if you liked a little or a lot of dressing. I like a little salad with my dressing. <laughs> but that's just me. You so know? you can put both. I, um, I, you know, I just don't know how people ate vegetables before dressing. <laughs> you know. So look, twelve of these rolls come in a bag in the bakery section, like I had said, for three dollars and ninety-seven cents. Wow, that's a good deal. So you can feed twelve people Caesar salad. That's a that's a lot. That is a for lot. Four dollars. And I do I, I do find the rolls that are in the bake section, as opposed to you know where all the loaves of bread are, they tend to be a little different texture wise. I find them sometimes a little softer. They just to right, me it's so, just so look the ham. You see this hamburger yeah. roll? This is how it comes out. The hoard the hoarder roll. This is how it comes yeah. out. So it's a little different. The crispiness is going to be a little different, but um. It's still the same and the same same flavor. And just put this in here. Yeah, so put it in there. Oh, how cool! You know I like a presentation. Yeah, you know you do. I like pretty food. Am I doing this right? Then I don't know. You're Look. more artsy. I'm gonna let you do it. You just stick it in there. Oh, so this nice. is, this is a side salad, okay? This will go with spaghetti, pork chops, you know, and then look, sprinkle that Boom. Parmesan on there, and you don't need any extra croutons. This is nice. This comes out really cool. I love this. You know, Stacy, the frosted <laughs> apron, always something very cool for Monday manger. Hey, you know what? We're gonna go back to you in the studio. I love this crouton. crouton. All right, guys. Still